So, we have just absolutely spanked Barte Borisov 6-0 at the Emirates tonight. And that was Arsene Wenger's 700th win as Arsenal manager. Um, the stadium was absolutely dead. Less than 30,000 people there. Arsenal claiming that they sold 50,000 tickets for that game. Nah. What, are you telling me 20,000 couldn't be asked to turn up? They never bought tickets in the first place, mate. The guy who commentated on the game done my fucking Sweden with a pronunciation of Enketia, he was calling him Nekatia. Jesus Christ, do these people not do their fucking homework? Anyway, on to the game itself. We went to a back four tonight. I thought Debucci was absolutely brilliant. I thought all of the back four were brilliant, to be fair. Uh, Maitland-Niles, he's impressed massively in this competition so far this season. But Debucci scored an absolute amazing goal. Um, no backlift on the ball at all. Just levered it straight into the back of the net. Should have been a penalty. Wasn't given. And obviously we scored off of the back of it anyway. So it's irrelevant. Um, the goals tonight overall I thought were top draw. Jack Wilshere took his goal superbly. And he then set up later in the second half. Emmanuel... No, Mohamed. Emmanuel? Where am I getting that from? Mohamed El um, who I thought scored goal of the night. I thought that was absolutely fantastic. Great finish from not an attacking minded player, really. Only his second goal for the club. His first goal was against Barcelona. His second was against Barte. But they all count. Um, it was a professional performance. I thought the lads did well. The substitutes done well. One thing I do want to say. And it's not a negative, people will take it as a negative, but Danny Welbeck, not good enough for Arsenal. Um, yes, he's physical, yes, he's got pace, but he is absolute trash in front of goal. And ultimately, he's there to score goals. Um, also, Theo Walcott as well. I thought he was a bit better tonight than he has been in some of the other games he's played this season. But again, if you want to get in that first 11 for Premier League matches, you have got to do a whole lot more. And last but not least, Olivier Giroud. I thought Olivier Giroud was poor again. Um, looks to me like he just don't seem like he's on it. I don't know whether it's the fact that he wanted to move, changed his mind and now he's regretting it, or whether he still wants a move, or whether he's just not on it. I don't know. Um, all three of them were really, really poor. But we won 6-0. It is what it is, and we roll on to Southampton away on Sunday, a 12 o'clock kickoff in Southampton. I'm looking forward to that game. I'll be at that game myself. I'm going to have to set an alarm for about 6 o'clock in the morning to get up and get ready. Not looking forward to that. <laughs> Jesus, I don't even get up at that time in the mid midweek, let alone on a Sunday. But there we go. Before I go, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Put the bell on, the notifications. You'll never miss anything along the way. Thanks for all the recent comments, thanks for all the likes and everything like that. And don't forget you can follow my Twitter, LeeGunner82, and my Instagram, LeeGunner82. Anyway, peeps, I'm out of here. Laters.